Uh, hi, Ralamohela Mokot Switching 2020. Uh, today, we're going analytical, analytical geometry. And then, more analytical geometry, we're going to the distance. Sometimes, we're going to the length between two points. The midpoint of a line segment. The gradient. Uh, using the gradient formula. The angle of inclination. Parallel lines. Perpendicular lines. Uh, and collinear points. So, retla tomaha peka the distance between two points. So, how are file the points to be di? Suppose, parifa point A, le point B. So, retoma fela ka the distance between point A and point B. So, the first thing, the distance. So for distance, the distance between two points a and B. So, in terms of the analytical geometry, is that we uh, can calculate a distance between two points, let's say point A. Right, a point, but refer a point as X and Y. So, we can do X, A. And then give a happy Y A. So this is point A, Lady Kunit Zion. And then I'm going to have happy point B. Again, if Kinale point, but on Payona as A, X, and Y. So we give it X, B, and then Y, B. So now, we will calculate the distance between A and B. We will the formula So the formula is D equals the square root of. So the square root is x1 minus x2. Everything should be squared. And then plus y1 minus y2. Happy u square everything. And then everything should be katlasa square root. So no, this distance happy wahono ingwala is the square root of x2 minus x1 all squared plus y2 minus y1 all squared so if we check formula a ya pele le formula ya bubedi eba ntwe e1 ka ba kala gore in the first formula re thomile ka substitute x1 ra subtract x2 from yon and then ra square everything plus let's calibala this plus it's very important and then second bracket renale y1 minus y2 hape u square everything so how no decide a hore u tomaka x2 minus x1 leka mo y u write the same thing wa tomaka y2 minus y1 
So now, when you find the distance between AB, retori the distance between AB is going to be given by, and then a rebon. So when we are looking at point AB, write to A, what A before B, modulating the, the, the alphabet, okay? So now it means this one, it over x1 yarona and then yaba y1 warona and then how ya go b yaba x2 warona and then yaba y2 warona so now how you substitute now the idea more distance formula or more analytical geometry the idea ke gore o gono substitute correctly now, a rebon, if we are using the first version, hora hore, x1 warona, it over x at a. And then x2, it over x at b. And then y1, it over y at x at b. I mean y at a minus y at b. So, ra substitute, no. Bula di brackets because the brackets di mo formulaing rabon, okay? So, now what is x1? x1 is x at a. x at a minus x ko gai ko point b and then rerang re square everything plus so hari change the formula ra substitute fail y2 yona eva y i mean y1 eva y at a minus y at b and then again, the square everything. And then, once we substitute the values, we are straight go calculating the and then we create the answer. So, what we need to know distance is the length. Distance or the length. Every time how to calculate the distance or the length. This it on na positive. Always. So there is no way you are going to calculate distance wa gra or gra a negative value. No. But always it over positive because if ever negative, if we have renal number under the square root of negative, and then we get a non real number which era uh, our, our, our solution to be non-real and then high exist. So now, I'm just going to take another example here the numbers. No. So, I'm just going to quickly erase the substitution and then give it the number that need. So no, a rebon. If by refer A as a rebon A, uh, so A by refer as minus two and minus three. And then bar refer the coordinates up B bar ke four and minus five. So every time ha barifa point twenty talohanya for a point bar refer yona as X le Y. Every time. So hura hore 
x wa rona mo a ito ba minus 2, and then y mo a ibe minus 3. And then go b, x iba, minus, iba 4, and then y iba minus 5. So no, haba re, renyaka distance between a, b. So the distance between a, b, rebere kisa either formula ve, the version a na ya pili, or the version ya bubeiti. So if rebere kisa the formula ya pili, so the distance between a, b, so utlo toma wangwala a, b, war, it's going to be, Erebon x1 minus x2 all squared plus y1 minus y2 all squared. So this one, re chusa hore ibe x1 wa rona. This one yaba y1 wa rona. And then ena yaba x2 ya rona. And then yaba y2 ya rona. So ra substitute. From the formula x1 minus x2, x1 wa rona, rabona khoreke minus 2. Minus, and then y x2 ya rona, ke 4. And then resquera everything. Plus, and then y2, y2 ya rona, I mean y1 ya rona, it's minus 3. Minus. So this minus, it's one more formulaing. But how do check y2 warona? y2 warona o negative. So I open a bracket. And then, wabala, the bracket, how, how, how will you wabula the bracket stay 2? How to allah happy to answer to allah the bracket stay 2? So rabona 1, 2. And then I only have 1. Hora hora, I need to close with another 1. And then I have the same amount of brackets opened as the number of brackets closed. So, kito intro encourage a hore. Once ufita after the substitution here, what you need to do, why a straight go calculating a haho, wa calculator the distance between A, B. So, har calculator using our calculator, retokre a hore. A, B, ke, just a moment, A, B is going to be. Right, okay, minus 2, minus 4, erefa, minus 6, and then minus 6, all squared, erefa, 36. So, require 36. Plus, minus 3, minus into minus 5, so minus 3, plus 5 it's 2 and then 2 squared is 4 and then regra hore we have the square root of 40 again right wanna hore answer yaruna e positive so the square root of 40 returns a hore ring while in simplest set form so in simplest set form the square root of 40 is going to be 2 root 10. And then, because the re re distance, it's going to be in distance units or just units. And then, come ho, we calculate le, the distance between A and B. Right. So, the next thing that we need to be able to calculate, to answer the re calculator, the midpoint of any line or the midpoint uh, between two points. So very soon we are just recalculate calculator young the the midpoint between two points. Yanung renyako calculator the gradient or the midpoint between two points. So the midpoint between two points kapele kitlotlosa ka eraser this whole thing the distance between two points. So everything is within the same analytical geometry. 
re saira analytical geometry so re bone gore distance between two points re kra yang so no tswantse re gono kriya the midpoint between two points so the nice thing ka maths ke gore ga o ga o gono kriya the midpoint between two points tswantse o gone gore ha ba ufa the midpoint o gone gore o kriye the coordinates of point a a ngwe similarly ka distance if ba ufa the distance and then ba re calculate x or y value le gona tswantse o gono calculator so now we are moving on to the distance between two points Right. So midpoint between two points So midpoint again Yagarebo Niko the distance formula the midpoint between two points lona in a le formula formula thing is x1 plus x2 all over 2 so twantse re tlhalohanya something midpoint so midpoint e tlo ba point magareng ga di points tsa gago so you are trying to find point a magareng ga di points tse 2 tse o batlang tse o bolelang ka tsona so if you have points x1 and x2, y1 and y2, so midpoint that's on it over x1 plus x2 divide by 2. And then you have 1 y1 plus y2 leona y divider got 2. And then what's the bracket? So how will the bracket here on? Ehofa the x coordinate ya midpoint, ehofa the y coordinate ya midpoint. So ena yona is straightforward. So again, erebo nenge. If ba refa hore the coordinates a a, eba minus two and minus three. And then the coordinates ta b, yaba four and minus five. So, right to hurry. This one, eba x1 yarona. This one, eba y1 yarona. And then, this one, obviously, x2, y2. Right one of And then now, what we do, Renault calculator fell up by substitution. So, ra substitute. x1 yarona ke mang, we go to a, it's minus 2. And then, Renault locula minus 2. Oscar change a formula. After minus 2 plus yala tail. And then x2 k4. And then renwa la 4. And then again, hari change a formula. Rativira ka 2. And then reako y. And then y yona y1 eba minus 3. And then plus y2 yona eba minus 5. So again, hari change a sepe. Reno substitute a fail. And then 
from here we go and write down the coordinates in a simplified version or in simplest form so re tlo kre gore -2 plus 4 ke 2 and then 2 divide by 2 ke 1 so the x at the midpoint ke 1 and then minus 3 plus into minus 5 so it means minus 3 minus 5 re gra minus 8 minus 8 divide by 2 re gra minus 4 so it means the coordinates ta midpoint ya rona it lo ba minus uh, 1 and minus 4 and then another thing sometimes the midpoint they don't usually ga ba ibitse ka m sometimes bana le gore eh ngwala di coordinates ta 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 t which is the midpoint of ac and then ga ba re t then it means you remove the letter m wa ngwala t and then ha le b you remove the letter p i mean m wa ngwala p so kwa dipenda gore ba ba go file gore di coordinates tsa tsa midpoint ga go ba di fa letter e feng e kana any letter of the alphabet it's not always going to be m right so this is how you you calculate your midpoint we just use the formula formula ya thing x1 plus x2 divide by 2 and then semicolon y1 plus y2 divide by 2 and then one will substitute the failure. Right. So now, if I refer something like this. So let's say, bare M. I refer the coordinates at midpoint. Bare ke 1, le minus 4. Rabon. So bare M, ke 1, le minus 4. And then, bare recalculate the coordinates ta x ta a so ba re recalculate the coordinate ta a ba re fa di the coordinate ta m and then m ba re keng ke midpoint so twantse re khono ngwala di coordinate ta m twantse re khono kra di coordinate ta ta a a ba re file midpoint so ha itwe nyi eu Again, we are going to do exactly the same thing that we have been doing. But now, ra level la khore go iragarang. So, ba re file eng, ba re file di coordinate midpoint. So, I'm just going to erase here. So, ha ba re file di coordinate tsa midpoint. Re ngwala so Retore, okay. Raiti ko M, hore. M at the midpoint. X at the midpoint. X ko midpoint. Rekreleka hore. Reta X1. Ramu eda ko X2. Ramu divide ka 2. Right. And then why ya midpoint rekrela ka gore re tse y1 ramo eta ko y2 ramo divide ka 2 len so now ra substitute fail and then x ko midpoint ke 1 a gere ra bon x ko midpoint ke 1 so ra substitute equals x1 x1 ya rona Ere x plus x2 yaron x2 yaron ere 4 and then red divide ka 2 and then from here twanza resolve for x a resolve for x red multiply ka 2 both sides and then har multiply ka 2 har multiply 1 e ka 2 red ka 2 and then how to multiply this whole fraction ka 2 regra x plus 4 and then retire this 4 reisa ka and then iba negative so renali 2 minus 4 we get minus 2 and then this minus 2 it will refer x ya point a so hora hore x at a i'm going to use a subscript a roa it hore x at a Ke mang no, ke minus 2. And then similarly, 
we do the same for y. y at m, rabona y go m ki minus 4. Ra substitute. Minus 4. This gives us y1 ki y plus y2 ki minus 5. Divide by 2. Again, we do the same as what we did here. We multiply both sides ka 2. We multiply ka 2 both sides. Rekreakore, granale minus 8. This should give us y minus 5. And then, retranspose this minus 5. Iba positive. So, granale minus 8 plus 5. And then, regra minus 3. So, hora hore, y at a. Yona eva minus 3. And then hora hore he, the coordinates are A. X ya ting ke minus 2. And then Y ya ting ke minus 3. So you, twante o kono o ngwala, the coordinates ta midpoint. How about file the two other points? And then how about file one of the points, li midpoint ya ting. Obere kisa, yona method A, ho krea the other point. It doesn't matter which of the two you are given, but uberikisa o na yona method o na kukrea the other value. Right. So that's how you write, uh, find uh, the midpoint, and then given the midpoint, wa kona kape kuro o calculate the other coordinate or the other point. Right. So no retrofitel la raya calculating a gradient yeah a line right so ritual lapel no return ya go calculate a gradient yeah a straight line so who calculate a gradient yeah straight line a retroka a formula again so for gradient Formula ya tingi, barifa yona as something of this nature. Right, so gradient formula ya tingi. So the gradient barefa le formula. So in general, regarde mo analytical geometry. Rebereka ka di formula. So utwante kore uiti formula kore obereka fka formula fing, and then the idea ke kore ukono substitute correctly into the correct formula. So gradient mathematically refa symbol m. So gradient yona rare ke change in y all over change in x so ka change re ra gore o tlo tsaya y2 wa mo subtract ko y1 wa mo divide ka x2 wa mo subtract from x1 alternatively the gradient o ka ikrea again ka gore o tlo y1 minus y2 divide by x1 minus x2 so how to decide o chincha order from y2 to y1 and then le x u chincha order ya thing so it's either o bere y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 or o bere kisa yona e ya y1 minus y2 or x1 minus x2 right so now for gradient renale mifuta a2 ya gradient renale gradient a positive so renale a gradient that is positive so erekebereki se a correct form a symbol Right, so the correct symbol, if gradient ya kaho, e positive. 
so rar gradient is greater than zero so if gradient a positive then it means how level it's a line a half so in analytical geometry everything o yirang we level it so hora hore line a half is going to be sloping upwards and then if your gradient is negative and then by less than zero we mean hore gradient a half in negative so how calculate a gradient wa gra hore in negative how level it line a half line a half twenty even something of this nature yeah yeah go fat right so as an example Retro checker a gradient using again the points they ready for the first one or the for the first two. So looking at those two, this is what is going to happen. If bar refer the coordinates bar Renali point A again. Point A, Ergire so. So if Kinale point A, more fat, the coordinates are point A, Bampa as minus 2 and minus 3. And then Bampa point B. And then the coordinates are point B, Bampat's on as 2 and 1. So if you draw a line between point A and point B, so Ergebon, this is going to be my line between point A and point B. So how can you calculate a gradient that thing? Kya bona gore line ya ka e ya ko dim so gore gore ha ke calculate gradient ya ap ke expect a gore ke create a positive value so er re boneng gradient is given by the formula m equals y2 minus y1 all over x2 minus x1 so again I dare more analytical geometry ke substitute a fail. So ra substitute y2 it lo twako coordinate b. So x2 y2. So we just following the letters of the alphabet. x1 y1 ra substitute y2 yaga ke 1 minus y1 ke minus 3. Again, more bracketing again. So, are you confused in minus wa formula le minus wa wa y1? And then, x2 yaga k2. Minus, again, x1 waka ke minus 2. And then, ke kra ho gradient yaga ke minus 1, minus into minus 3, ke 1 plus 3, which gives me a 4. All over, 2 into minus 2, and then kikra if a positive so kikra four all over four and then hora hora gradient daka ke one again this one is indeed positive or greater than zero so that's why kikra le line a a angodim alternatively if kinya kobere kisa this formula a ki substitute a mo a y one waka ke minus three minus and then y2 waka ke 1 all over x1 yaka ke minus 2 minus and then minus 2 so on the numerator ke gra minus 4 on the denominator ke gra minus 4 and then ke abona gore a negative haki divide aka negative ingwe iba positive and then a 4 divide by 4 ke 1 so again, one marker is greater than zero. Hence, my line is sloping upwards. 
So ever gradient A, that's how you use, you calculate a gradient of a straight line. So using the formula y2 minus y1 all over x2 minus x1 or y1 minus y2 all over x1 minus x2, you are able to calculate the gradient. So if reba with another point, suppose ba refa another point no. And then that point by Vitaka Horeke point C. So if point C, Barifa point C is something of this nature. So how about Barifa the coordinates to point C? And then bar find the gradient between point C. I mean, C, and then the coordinates are C, Eva, 4 and minus 5. So, find the, dis the, the gradient between point A, C. So, Rabona for point A, C, line your thing, A, go fat. So, we expect to find a negative gradient. So, again, Ra substitute y2 aga between a and c this one is going to be our y2 and then this one is going to be our x2 so ra substitute uh, y2 error on eva minus 5 minus and then we get a minus 3 and then right divide aga 4 which is x2 minus into minus 2 so a reborning regrabu guy. So regra minus five minus into minus regra a positive. Right? So regebone uh, right. Oh negative into negative regra a positive. So regra minus five plus three. Divide by four plus two. And then minus 5 plus 3 divided by 4 plus 2 regra minus 2 all over 6, which is simply minus 1 all over 3. So Rabona Hore, this line from A to C, you are actually going down. Hence, regra Hore gradient Rona is negative, which is less than 0. So again, we expect our line to be actually going downwards. So that's why regra a negative gradient right so gradient again we'll substitute a more formula formula thing y2 minus y1 all over x2 minus x1 or we're gonna have a register y1 minus y2 divided by x1 minus x2 right when i let the line we have our calculator the gradient so this other way now reverend is an inclination angle so ka inclination angle, inclination angle, ke angle e u i formang, e e e e e e e e formwa ki ki ke line ya kaho with the positive x axis. So let's see how we can do it. Right. So inclination angle or angle of inclination. So Rifa, the symbol theta. Angle of inclination is given by theta. I mean It is given by the tangent of theta gives you m. And right for m kenge ki gradient. Right. So the angle of inclination ke angle e we formang le line kaho with the positive x axis. So here our x axis. Here we find our y axis. 
So now an angle of inclination, it over an angle formed by your line. So our line go on a, and then it means this angle right here, this angle right here is going to be our angle of inclination. And then we create that angle of inclination. Hora hora, twenty o create enge m, and right to m is given by y two minus y one all over x two minus x one. And then alternatively, if bako file the angle of inclination, you should be able to calculate the gradient because we substitute a fella and then we create angle of inclination. Yeah. So now, as an example, suppose Renale point B, and then the coordinates are point B are on a k two le one, and then Renale point A, point A k minus two le minus three, and then angle of inclination are on a it lower. The tangent of theta is given by y2 minus y1 all over x2 minus x1. And then, ragra horeke y2 yarona eba 1 minus into minus 3 all over uh, 2 minus into minus two and then ragra hore ke one so hora hore the tangent of theta is one and then our solver for theta our theta is going to be reza the inverse ten because the solver for theta here the inverse ten of m our m being one and then ragra hore theta yarona iba 45 degrees. Hora hore. Line A arona. Ira an angle of 45 degrees with the positive x values. So alternatively, how about file the angle of inclination? Twanza o kono krea the gradient. So if m is, okay, not m, but if theta is 45, therefore, the tangent of theta echofa the gradient. So hora hore the ten of forty five gives us m. But the ten of forty five is one. Hora hore our gradient is one. Right. So that's how you find the angle of inkly nation right so we are now going to move to parallel and perpendicular lines so parallel and perpendicular lines eh uh, so here we like parallel and perpendicular lines eh uh, it's nothing new so retlo thoma ka parallel lines so Parallel lines. Here the lines are parallel. Hora hore. The lines denali gradient e twanang. So the gradient. And right to hore gradient refa m is the same. So hora hore the gradient. How kra gradient ya line a one. Twanza e twanele gradient ya line a ngweche. The gradient is the same. So the parallel lines udi bona gang. So utlobale line 1. Wabakhape le line 2. So haukaru wa cheka line 1 le line 2. This one we call it line two. This one revisa line one. So line one eva le gradient 
M1, line 2, Eberle gradient M2. So if these two lines are parallel, the gradient of line 1, it will turn exactly the, the gradient of line 2. And then, line 1, and then repeat this symbol to represent parallel. So this symbol is if you have parallel lines. Then you can conclude if M1 is finally M2, then line 1 is parallel to line 2. And then for you to prove that two lines are parallel, again, M king gradient. And like we have seen in the previous uh, slides, M, we crack our calculator M1 y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1 so now try to calculate that one and then in a question paper but we want to two lines are parallel although they want to the arrows day two so so once we we'll the lines day two we'll the, and then these lines they have arrows pointing in the same direction and then this line and this line they are parallel the gradient starts on they are to exactly right and then similarly you don't necessarily have two lines being parallel by going upwards if you have a line that is going downwards and then you have another line that is going downwards and then these two lines are parallel if you are told hore this one and this one are parallel so how about a line and then both are the arrows so then why it's a this line and this line they are parallel hora hore the gradient of this one is the same as the gradient of the other one that's parallel lines and then retroya on the next set of lines so the next set of lines rare the lines are perpendicular again cafe taka because uh, we have already touched on the gradient so Perpendicular and parallel lines, the focus is on the gradient. Refocus a holomo gradient. So let's see. If Revolela no ga the perpendicular lines, hora hore now. Perpendicular lines. And then if lines are perpendicular, Reberekisa, the symbol. Hora hore. Wherever they meet, they form a 90 degree angle. So hora hore. Wherever they meet, they form a 90 degree angle triangle i mean 90 degree angle so otakra gore o nale line a1 excuse me for that so otakra gore you have line 1 and then line 1 o ya go di muso and then you have a second line and then the second line is going down here and then gore gore where these two lines meet here Deformer a 90 degrees triangle. So now again, for perpendicular lines, for perpendicular lines, how the gradient ya line 1, we multiply the gradient ya line 2. Every time, their product, the alpha minus 1. So hurrah, hurrah, how calculate le this gradient? Let's call it M1. We calculate this gradient. We M2. So gradient, we calculate exactly the same way as we did with the previous ones. So how calculate the gradient here, yeah, line 1? We calculate the gradient here, yeah, line 2. How do you multiply? And then we create a or minus 1. Then it means hore, line 1 is going to be perpendicular to line number two and then that's how you prove that two lines are perpendicular 
we'll calculate a gradient data line one, we'll calculate a gradient data line two, and then their product, how do you multiply the two of one minus one every time? And then similarly, how about we'll a gradient data line one? And then why it's a hore gradient data line one, how we multiply the gradient data minus two, yeah, line two, the offer minus one. Okay, no calculator either this gradient or this gradient because you know hore their product is always going to be minus one that's a perpendicular lines and then the last thing that we are going to touch on now is going to be on collinear points So no retro focus are on collinear points. So for for collinear points, again, not a, a, a lot needs to be considered. Collinear points. Collinear points. So you break the name, the weight down. Collinear. Hora hore. Co means together, together. Co leak, we work together. So it means all, all lie on the same straight line. So linear means straight line. So co all. So it means collinear points, all the points lie on the same straight line. So collinear points, all points. lie on the same straight line right so if all points lie on the same straight line then if we have these points a point B point C if A, B, C are collinear hora hore they lie on the same straight line because they lie on the same straight line then it means they share the same gradient so they share the same They share the same gradient. So how calculate the gradient between A B? How calculate the gradient between A B? Otlokra Hore Itwana lay the gradient between B C and then that gradient Yatwana when you calculate the gradient between A B and C. So again for collinear points the focus is on the gradient. So you need to prove that when you find the gradient between A and B that gradient is going to be exactly the same as the gradient between B and C which is also going to be the exactly the same as A and C. So that's how you prove that points are collinear. And then this will wrap up our first session here. I mean, this will wrap up the session on analytical geometry.